I am under in between cross two. But this is not my specific name. Uh, you can call me preposition. And this is our topic today. Preposition. So I show you a class with me. We present in our group number five. And these are my partners. Shaurya Malik, Pranshi and Shivam. So we all are going to tell you about preposition and its time. So let's get started. And at the last we have an amazing and interesting activity with us. So now, now let me tell you what are actually prepositions. So prepositions are the word that are used to build up a link between a pronoun or a noun with other words in a syntax. Uh, some common prepositions are like under, between, in, on, cross, through and etc. Now let's talk some examples. Like we have our module in this like the man is sitting on the chair, the car is under the shelter and there are so many. Now let's come to the kinds of prepositions. So we will cover three kinds of prepositions. The three kinds will be preposition of place, preposition of time and preposition of direction. Now my friend, Shaurya Malik will explain the photo. So, so as you know that uh, Shaurya explained all about the preposition and the name of preposition. So now I am going to explain that what are the preposition of place. So the preposition of place shows that where something is. Uh, for example, that the dog is on the couch, uh, the coffee table is in front of the couch. So now we are going to discuss that what are the some common preposition of place. So the some common preposition of place are such as in, under, between, in front of, above and much more. And that is about the preposition of place. Let's move to the second kind that will be explained by Tranche. So as the board has explained you all about preposition and preposition of place, I am going to explain you about preposition of time. Preposition of time is a preposition that allows you to discuss about a specific time. For example, one of a day of a week, a date on a calendar and a specific time something that takes place. Preposition of time they are used in months, years, centuries and a long period of time. So some examples are like she will need to add 5 o'clock, one is on 6 o'clock September. So that's all about preposition of time. Let's go to the last but not the least. That is preposition of direction. That will be covered by Shiro. the least. That is preposition of direction. That will be covered by Shiro. So, preposition of direction. Preposition of direction is a preposition that expresses the relationship of noun or pronoun with regard to direction and movement. Some prepositions of directions are besides, behind, from, to, across, along, around, etc. Some examples of preposition of directions are like the man is going to the house, towards the house. The word is the preposition of direction. Second example like Sony is going to the market. So here two is the preposition of direction. Uh, now we have an interesting activity related to music, uh, which is uh, like a music on the preposition. So let's get start with that. Of 